This is so funny. When I was in, when I was a kid in rural, I actually eat lunch somewhere that is not my house. Okay, I would go, I would play with kids, and then when the lunch comes, I don't even say like um, I'm going. Like oh, you guys are having lunch. I'm gonna go now. Bye bye. No, I would just go on the dining room too and eat with <laughs> my playmate. <laughs> Now that I think about it, it's kind of rude, no? But maybe it's like a thing, I don't know. Sometimes I would meet this friend or a uh, playmate that I only met for one day. Because we just saw each other walking. And then we would play together and then when it's lunchtime, I would just go into their house too. And the parents don't even know me, you know? They don't even know me! And they would feed me. And then at dinner, I go back home. I help with the chickens. Yeah, I usually release the chickens in the morning and I also um, uh, try to catch them. At night. Sometimes in the afternoon when uh, when you hear a lot of When you hear that, it means that they lay eggs. So I would go outside and check if they have eggs and stuff. And sometimes they would bite my hands and I would cry. I also tried to butcher chicken once. It didn't go well. And then after that, I stopped. That's that's my mom's side. My dad's side, uh, I go a little cuckoo, you know? My dad's side, it's also a rural, a rural place, but there's a river in there. And there's this one time, uh, my nanny is uh, like, she got invited to drink somewhere because you know in rural places that's what they do most of the time they just drink and so i left i got left attended unattended you know so i was just like <laughs> i went to the river and i was there for like eight hours you know filipinos they have a little bit of a complex when it comes to like skin you know when you were a kid you don't really care about anything right so when i come back home i was so tanned really tanned like super tanned <laughs> and my nanny was like what the fuck happened <laughs> She got so scared. She thinks she's gonna be in trouble. My dad walked in and he was like, What happened here? Okay. And then I went back. That's it. <laughs> My mom freaked. I was like, What happened? And then after that, they never let me near the river ever again. It's a really long river, so there's a bridge you have to cross. So there's a bridge. There's a, a hanging bridge. The people could cross there. But most of the time, the horses would cross the, the big bridge. And sometimes, like, because everyone's so friendly on the rural, I would look at the horses sometimes and I'm like, whoa. And then, uh, you know, the farmers who was like uh, walking the horse in the in the river, they were like, do you want to ride the horse? And I'm like, can I? So um, I got uh, a free horseback riding from one side of the river until the end. And you know, I was like a kid, five years old. The current for a five-year-old kid on this really big river is crazy. So they dropped me off at the end, other side of the river and I can't go back. I was so scared. And there's no more horse coming around. So, um, I was just like, uh, where do we go? So the only way is to the, the hanging bridge. The hanging bridge is the scariest thing ever. So I, I tried to cross and I almost like pee my pants because I was so afraid. So I tried to cross and I couldn't do it and I started crying. I started crying and then there's another farmer that came in and was like, what are you doing? It's like, I, I want to go back to the other side of the river, but I can't because it's a hanging bridge. And they carried me. They, they did the... They did the piggyback ride on me. I was still scared too. I was still very scared. I was like crying so hard. And then they sent me across the street and then he was like, here you go. And then they gave me like a, a suman to, to make me stop crying, I guess. Yeah, they're so nice. I don't even know these farmers. I also used to collect like these pink slugs. One time, I tried to make a collection of the pink... Uh, like, I got a jar. And then there's like pig, pink slugs that you see on the rocks. I don't know what are those actually. I just grab it. They're like this. So they found these on the riverside. Oh, it's a snail egg? Yeah, I collected a lot of those and you know, I was like, hell yeah, a prize collection. And then I, I showed it to my nanny and she freaked out. She's like, what the fuck are you taking? She confiscated it and I never seen it again. Yeah, that's about it. That's my adventure. Also, you can see like floating spiders too on the river. Disgusting. Yeah, that's why I'm banned from the river. Boom, boom, bam, boom, 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 bam, bam.